Shantae Lundy, the owner and creator of Black Girl Sunscreen, created a SPF 30 lotion for women of color in 2016. After seeing how what was on the shelves wasn't working for her, she had realized that she became her own target market. Welcome everybody, it's your girl Deanna Diaz, business coach, entrepreneur, aka your business bestie, and I am switching up my content a little bit. Hopefully you guys will still find value in what I am putting out. All my business videos and how-tos will now be located on my website, DeannaDiaz.com. You can still get tips and tricks on Instagram and lifestyle stuff on TikTok. I'm still reachable on Facebook as well, so please don't feel like I have left you all out because I have not. Forgive my voice, I am hoarse and I am coming to you straight from Alaska. So if you're new, welcome and if you're returning, welcome back. Now, what was the problem with the regular sunscreen? It had a severe white cast on anyone who wasn't white. She started selling her product, Black Girl Sunscreen, in Target and Ulta in 250 stores. Now she's selling her product in 12,062 stores, at least nationwide. As of May 2023, Disney has collaborated with Black Girl Sunscreen for the release of the live-action film, The Little Mermaid. The marketing couldn't have come at a better time because it is officially time to travel for the summer season. Three ounces is going for $18.99 and the 1.7 ounce is going for $17.99. At this time, the collaboration is only being sold at Ulta Beauty. And that is another reason why her product does so well because it's in small packages which means you can carry it on a plane carry it on your carry-on and it's easier to move around now why does this make sense if you missed it Haley Bailey a black American singer plays the lead role Ariel in the live-action Disney film Haley is in the two-woman group with her sister Chloe Bailey the connection between black women and outside is a strong one and having sunscreen to protect us from illnesses like skin cancer and still keep us looking natural is a steal all on its own. Do you think this collaboration was a good one? What else is on your mind about this collaboration? If you've tried Black Girl Sunscreen before, what are your thoughts? And thank you so much for watching today's episode. Make sure that you like, comment, subscribe, and share if you care. I'll be catching you all on the next episode. And don't forget, you can go to DeannaDiaz.com for all your entrepreneurial needs, tips, tricks, hacks, printables, downloadables, all that good stuff. Anything that you need to help you run your business and schedule a meeting with me so that I can personally help you with your business. I am here for you. Make sure you take care. God bless. And don't forget, we the blessed.